think um, continuing to partner with community organizations to engage in political education is really important. Right now you have a captive audience because people can't go to you know community centers as often as they would because of COVID, but there are so many opportunities for people to learn online. And I, um, I, we always try to stress that like state violence exists on a continuum, all the way from interacting with community in the streets to the violence of the death penalty or state sanctioned murder. And we have, but the, the in between, the people who do not die are the ones who are most, um, that, that's where your numbers are going to be. The people who are um, sentenced to life imprisonment, uh, people who are sentenced to die, um, people who are in sentence to who are sentenced to life equivalent sentences, like they might as well have a life sentence because of how long they're going to end. The children who are robbed of their childhood by the criminal legal system, those people are invisibilized in a lot of ways, and they're made the boogeyman. They are the people that we're taught to be so afraid of that they don't deserve services and care. Mm-hmm.